Hi guys, it's be right. We're going to do a comic book uh, effect from a photograph. I'm going to do it with a couple of photographs to give you a full idea of how it works. I'm also going to show you how to make sure you can do it a lot quicker. Right, get your photo, make a background copy. Filter. So first of all, first we want to give it a bit of a blur. So blur, surface blur. Play about with these. I'll use these settings, it's up to you. Back to filter. Okay, so poster edges. I'll just move this small in. So it's done a pretty good job already. Now, just play about the settings. Different photographs are going to be slightly different. After a few clicks, you'll get it how you like it. Okay, and just one more filter here. I'm going to cut out. Make this more again. No, not bad. The default settings is it's on. Again, I'm going to play around with this. Right. Now I'm after that. Let's do it on another photo. Okay, background copy. Right, this time I'm going to record what I do, so go to your actions, if you can't see where I've got it, it'll be under your Windows tab. So I'm going to record each step and then I can apply the whole thing to new photographs. So I'm going to do exactly what we did before, so go to Surface Blur, back into uh, the poster edges. Tidy it up a tad. Try to cut out again. You might like it as it is there, I'll just make a few changes. Stop. Okay, so I've stopped the playing or sorry, the recording there. So let's just close that down. I'm going to save the changes. Just open up that photo again. So back to the actions. You go to whatever you've named it as. Click. Go through their motions without you doing a thing. Nope. Again, if you want to, you could go menu settings. But I think mean, that looks pretty good. Any questions? Please leave a comment below. How come does it be? Okay. 